I finally figured out how to take a coherence measurement between the two channels with SR785. Uh, so right now we have the our two channels we want to check plug in, and right now we are at uh, we are doing an F50. Uh, we are in F50 mode. Well, normally I would have put this on, but there we go. So to get from uh, normal F50 mode. Oh, what the hell happened here? Uh, there we go, it's locked again. Uh, to go from F50 mode, uh, a usual spectrum measurement mode that we are on, to a coherence measurement mode. First of all, we have to make sure that your input here is dual channel. So independent channel or dual channel doesn't make any difference to the spectral, uh, spectrum measurement, but it matters for this coherence because we want to use both of these guys here. Otherwise, the measurement is going to be bullshit. Uh, now you want to go, you're already in FFT, so that's totally fine. Now you want to go on to coherence. Well, actually, the coherence was grayed out when I did not select uh, dual channels input. So yeah, never mind the bullshit measure, uh, measurement part. You couldn't even take a measurement. And now, what the hell happened here? Yep, there we go. There's our measurement and the unit doesn't matter because they're divided, they're one over each other anyway. Here is... Hmm... Okay. That is a bit funny. I thought that was 0.9 earlier. What the hell is going on? It is locked. But, hmm, 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 I am baffled. Ah, I see. I think you still need to take out that PSD. So go back to F51. Unit. PSD off and back to coherence. Now it's almost one. That makes more sense. Not sure you can see this, but here you are. All right, that's it. That's your. That's how to take a coherence measurement with SR785.